show you how to do this doll makeup look and this is what it looks like okay so this is the look I'm gonna go for just big doll eyes and here's my eyes before the makeup is done so as you can see there's a dramatic difference first off I'm going to part my eyes with an eyeshadow base today I'm just using Michael Todd's shadow base you can use whatever you have at home and I'm gonna put some on top and at the bottom next I'm gonna use a white eyeliner and I'm just going to just color in the lid area with this pencil just like that and then I'm just going to blend it out next I'm going to grab my NYX trio in ultra chic and it just comes with a bunch of pearly white colors and I'm going to use the matte white color right over here with my Sigma shader brush just pack some on and I'm going to apply this all over my lids right on top of the white pencil so this will just make the white more vibrant Next you want to grab a blue eyeliner. I'm using Annabelle's Smooth Liner in Meteorite. And it's just a really dark navy blue and it goes on really smooth which is why I like it. And I'm just going to draw a line right where my crease is. So right over here. And then just darken it up. Pull the color up. And then grab a pencil brush and just smudge it out a bit. Now I'm going to use my L'Oreal Hip Duo in Sassy and I'm going to use this pretty color right here. It's a matte blue. And I'm just going to put some on my brush and I'm going to apply that right over the shadow. So I'm putting a lot of color right in the crease and then I'm just blending it upwards so it'll gradually fade as it's going up. And when you get to the very end, you can just drag it inwards like that. Next I'm going to use a matte skin tone color so I'm using Revlon's Vintage Lace and I'm just going to put some on the brush and I'm going to apply this as a highlight. So these are all matte colors. Now I'm going to grab a black eyeliner. This is Annabelle's Oh My Goth. And I'm going to just draw a line right underneath my real lash line. So I'm just going to go like this. And just attach it all the way. Next I'm going to grab the white eyeliner again. And I'm going to fill in that whole area with white. So now it looks like my eye whites. And I'm also going to set that white pencil with the white shadow again. So I'm just going to use the sponge applicator it came with. Just put some in there. Apply it to the white area. This also makes it more long wearing as well. Next I'm going to grab my eyeliner and my favorite is my L'Oreal Liner Intense. And I'm just going to line my top lash line. And I'm also going to make a wing. Now I'm going to curl my top lashes. Apply mascara to the top. You don't need to apply it to the bottom. And for lashes, I'll be using these really dramatic lashes along with my Lash Grip Adhesive. And I'm just going to apply a thin layer on top of the lash band. And I'm going to wait for at least 30 seconds for the glue to become a little bit tacky. And then I'm going to place it right above my real lashes. Okay, so here we go. Okay, so now the lashes are on, but I'm not quite done yet. Next, just grab another pair of lashes. Anything that looks like this or whatever you have. And what you want to do is just snip them into little pieces with your scissors like this. So I've already snipped mine. So I've already snipped mine into little pieces like this. 
And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to apply glue to the lash band. So I apply glue to the lash band like this and what you want to do is again wait for 30 seconds for it to become a little bit tacky. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply it right on that black line that I drew. So I'll put one right here. Just like that. And the shorter ones up here. So I'm going to put the last one right over here. So now you should have something that looks like this. And I'm actually going to do a double wing look. So as you can see over here, I added another wing at the bottom. I'm going to do the exact same thing over here. And I'm going to use those fake lashes as a guideline. So I'm going to place it right over here. So now you should have a double wing like this. And really big dolly eyes. So when you're all done, your eye makeup should look like this. And because this makeup is so dramatic and eye enlarging, it does make the iris look smaller. So I'm going to be wearing cosmetic lenses today. And the ones I'm wearing are circle lens. And these are the Geo Super Needy Blue. And they really give your eyes a dolly effect, which is why I like them. And I got these from Crystal Eyes or something. I'll post the link down below. And I'm just going to place it. Make sure your hands are clean. I already washed my hands just blink a few times. I'm just going to show you the difference. So here it is with the lens. As you can see, it really does give a dolly effect. Lens versus no lens. So it does make a big difference. I'm just going to pop the other one right in. So now both of my Super Nudie lens are on and please keep in mind that these are cosmetic lenses so you don't want to wear them for the whole day. I usually wear them for um, about four hours. So there you have it.